Hey, what is up guys? Welcome to RAM Overload. Today I'm going to show you guys how you guys can check whether a URL is scam or not. All right, so you probably got in some text message or emails or basically anything saying, oh, sign in here, this URL to get something or sign up or whatever. And you know, sometimes, most of the times you know it's a scam, but you know, there's always this one time where you're like, okay, is this legit or is it not? So you're not really sure so sometimes you click it or sometimes you just ignore it right so now this is like a way to kind of i wouldn't say a hundred percent but it's a good way to assess whether the website is uh fishy uh no pun intended um or not all right and what it is is virustotal.com so if you guys use virus total before in the past you've known that is to scan viruses in files you can upload any files and see um and test it uh, through a bunch of different um, you know virus scanners and see which one flags it as a virus or not okay so you can do that now you can do the same thing with URLs also so go to virustotal.com and go to URL okay so now what you want to do is just type in your URL so let's say Facebook Okay, so Facebook, you can see no vendor flagged this URL is malicious. Community detail linking, you can see what people say about this and all that. So, you know, these are all the different vendors, security vendors that scanned it and verify whether it's whether they find it um, clean or not. Okay, so there can be different ratings like virus, clean, fishy, or unwanted, or something similar to that sense, right? So you guys can see Facebook, relatively everyone said it's clean. Uh, let's go to another website. Let's say, um, I don't know, let's say Hack Forms. I think it's .net. Okay, so you guys can see over here, this secu two security vendors. Uh, flag this domain as malicious. So Dr. Web and SEC Lookup, they both say malicious and you know um, they can have their own reasons. But the thing is, a uh, majority of them say it's clean. And just because one says it's malicious it does not mean that it is malicious. Uh, there's just a different, the way they're, each one of their algorithms work is slightly different. So the way theirs works is probably um, different uh, is obviously different than there's the other ones that say it's clean and it, it could mainly be like you know they're scanning the keywords on the website if it says something um something that's suspicious they'll probably you know just to be safe say on the safe side uh mark it as malicious or something or some you know something not clean right and it, it's just a plethora of different things that they can check out to see whether it's um malicious or not okay so you can see the community over here um you know i don't know people are just being dumb but that being said uh you can see creation date this was uh 17 years ago so it's been out for quite a while last updated a year ago uh epic holdings incorporated top 100k um site so yeah this site i definitely knew was going to be marked as uh, malicious for at least uh some some of the providers but um you know i was surprised it's only two that being said, um, you know, take this with a grain of salt. It's just a high level overview of um, whether they think it's malicious or not. So, you know, if you do get a suspicious link that you're not sure of, if you put it in, if you see 10 of 10 people say it's malicious, you know, then that's something you might need to take in consideration. You know, 10 is quite a lot compared to just one or two. But if it's one or two, you can kind of ignore it. Or, um, you know, if you want to be on the safe side, you know just uh just don't go on the site but you know if it's something that you probably will go on or might need on the site then yeah definitely go for it i in my opinion uh i don't think two or you know somewhere around there is too bad uh that being said that's pretty much it you know this is how you check any url uh if you get anything in text or email or basically anywhere this is the first place you, where you should be putting it in and making sure that um it is not somewhat of a spam all right so yeah that's pretty much it for this video if you like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe if you have any questions or comments please leave it down below other than that peace out